Ryder Block, Fargo Junior Freestyle Champion at Iowa. First off, man, how's it feel? Uh, feels good. Um, everything past couple years hasn't gone my way here. Kind of been a fire under my butt to get it done because I'm running out of time. I got to get something done before I go to college, and it just feels good to finally get one done. And it feels good to know I'll be back for another one next year. Yeah, you said a few things went wrong. What, what specifically went wrong at Fargo, and how did those experiences kind of motivate you? Um, my first year cadet, I lost in the blood round of the round before, and then the same thing happened last year. So um, I guess that's just what went wrong. I was close, but you know I wasn't there, and then I knew I had to make some changes, make some some things happen for myself so I could get where I want to be. And, happened so that's where I'm at. What changed? Um, I think I'm just more, nothing really changed from a lifestyle standpoint. I make all the right choices. I don't do anything, anything dumb. I don't, I eat right. I do all that. I work out a lot. I, I feel like I'm a good person. I'm, I think it's just I'm more consistent in my matches. Like, I mean, here I had three, real, four really tough back-to-back-to-back -back -to -back guys from the round of 16 on and just being consistent in all those matches and not having one where I'm good and one where I'm bad. and Just really wrestling my best in all of them and knowing I can be the man. What has happened here that the Iowa juniors are doing so well? Um, I think we're all realizing we can come together and be one big group and we can win it as a, as a team for, for Iowa because we know where we're supposed to be and that's on top. And I mean, we got the signature Mark Ryan on our singlets. He's up there smiling. I would say that's what they're telling us the whole time at camp is that if we can't figure out how to do it for ourselves, we can at least figure out how to do it for him. Now, he would love to be here, but he can't be, so do it for him, come together as a state, and be where we're supposed to be and at. Many of you will be future Hawkeyes, is that true? Yeah, um, at least all five of us in the finals are supposed to be Hawks, so um, it's pretty exciting to be part of that, and then, uh, know we got a bright future in Iowa City, so yeah, it's good to be a, good to be a part of good company. How did the way things ended in Tulsa propel you forward into this tournament? Um, I was really good, actually. I I got pinned by somebody. I no offense, but I don't think I should ever get pinned by somebody. And then uh, you know I beat a couple pretty good guys down there, and it was like, hey, you're right there. You can be you can be the guy. And you know, just that's another eye opener. Really, is I need to be more consistent. First match, you can't get out there and get stuck and. Just think some lousy guy is going to roll over for you because everybody's here to win the stop sign. So I think that was an eye opener that leaving Tulsa is like, hey, I know I can be the guy. I can, I can do this thing. I just got however long it was until now, a month, month and a half. I got to get, get back to work, tidy up, and get ready to win the stop sign. What kind of adjustments were there in that match versus when you faced him down in Tulsa? Um, I think a lot of it, I mean, in the hotel or this morning, we're kind of, my, I think my knee's a little bit dinged up, but uh, they were telling me that doesn't matter anymore. I mean, it was a big match down there, but this is a lot bigger than it was for that. So um, it's, you, you can't look at it like it's a guy that you attacked in the beginning of the second period. And I mean, you know, I kind of killed him in Tulsa, and with respect to him here is a lot tougher than, than it was in Tulsa. So just knowing I need to, can't treat it like it's somebody I already beat. I got to, it's a new guy out there. I got to beat them just like I would anybody else here. Ryder, kind of going back to your match with the break, it was 2-2. Two -two. Uh, what was said in your corner? What changed from you to be able to just go out there and tech him? Um, knowing that I, I mean, he's tired. I'm not I'm not tired. I'm back in that corner telling him to stay, stay where I'm at, stay where I'm good. Wheels, Morningstar, TJ, everybody, you know, stay stay where I'm best, and that's when I'm moving and sticking what I'm sticking to my gun. So, um, yeah, I'd really just keep keep bounding the drum, pounding on the drum, and, It'll break, it'll crack eventually, and then when he did, i take advantage of it. Yeah, you're going to be coached by Morningstar in Iowa. How cool is it to kind of already start that relationship a little early? Uh, it's a lot of fun. I mean, it's uh, I've had it up and ups and downs this summer. Like when I got pinned, I mean, he, he was the first guy there telling me that can't happen. And then, uh, you know, this weekend it's been a lot of fun dominating some guys, beating some really good guys, and having him there. Uh, he's helped me warm up, get get better warm ups this tournament. So. Um, yeah, it's a lot of fun to be able to have him here for me. Writer uh, Siebel says in, in the Man of Steel camp, like, hey, we're looking for a leader. Yeah. We need a leader. Is, are, you the, are you the guy? 
Um, I, I, if you're a leader, you can't say, you can't just take the take the throne by saying you're going to be the guy. You got to lead by example. So I don't know if it's me or if it's Nate or if it. I mean, it could be Dre Sean. Just because he's 14 doesn't mean he can't lead the club. So I don't know if there's one defined leader. I would like to think I'm one of the guys that leads the, leads the charge for all of us. And um, I'm not going to say anyone in our club isn't the leader because. Anyone up and down the board could be the leader, and all of us would be fine. We they could lead us right in the battle. So, yeah. Congrats. Congrats, Rider Block champion, Fargo champion. Congratulations. Thanks.